All right. And um, please, I, I might pop my little face up to the camera now and again to check in. So please try and stick with it. Um, we'll be doing quite three exercises together. For the first, so it'll be squats, side steps, squat jumps. Um, we're doing 20, 20, 50. We're doing three sets. All right, so 150 reps. And then we're doing um, uh, one, two, three, four, four exercises in the next one. It'll be three standing and then press up at the end. And again, we'll be doing 50 on each uh, total. So it'll be another 150 exercises. And then we'll move on to the, the floor, okay? So it's going to be a tough enough session, but no bother to you. Okay, so the nice, nice session ahead. Okay. So start and standing. I just want to warm the body up because I know some people may not have been out. Okay, so just open the legs a little bit wider than hip distance apart. And we're just going to stick the bums out to the left and to the right, just to get the hips a little bit loose. Okay, and get them ready for any squatting positions we will be going into. Okay. If anyone, um, next week what I'm going to try and do is, I see, um, well, something that I wanted to do anyway is to try and get deeper into my squats. So I'm um, generally when I'm in the gym, I place things under my heels. So I'm just going to go in a little bit down and then back up, just to warm up. Um, so what we will do next week is just bring either a brush, like a sweeping brush, or some books to place under your heels, and just to get a little bit deeper into those squats. Okay, we'll practice that next week. Okay, so just warm the body. Don't go down too low initially. Okay. Just nice and relaxed. Give me one more. Okay, and then go a little bit wider, please. And we're just going to lean to the right and to the left. Okay. Good. Can't wait for this weather to get better. It's so cold. So, Emer, I hope with Felicity and Kerry, you get some sun shining. Good. And give me three more, two more, and one more. Okay. From there, guys, just we're gonna go for five lifts on the right side. Three. So this is just a warm up now. One and swap over. Five on the left. Four, three, two, and one. And then just lifting that right leg up for five, four, three. Two, one, and swap for five, four, three, two, and one. From there, it's going to be circles with the hips. So go forward, really pushing out to the right, exaggerate, sticking out your bum so your legs are straight, and then go to the left and all the way back to the front. Okay, big circles, slow circles. You get lovely stretches on the hip flexors here. Adductors here, hamstrings, and then adductor on the right side when you're sticking your bones to the left. So big circles, loosening up the lower back. And we're going to go the opposite way, please. Two more. One more. Good. Okay. The first three exercises we're starting with. Uh, first one will be squats, okay, so wide squats, sorry, a little bit wider than hip distance apart. We're going to start with that. I'm just going to show you first. Then we're going to do side steps, okay, 10 and 10. And then we're going to do squat jumps, okay, so down and up, okay. So that's why you need the runners. And we're doing three sets, okay, so it'll be 20, 20, 10. All right, so 20 squats to begin. So wide stance with the feet. You need to bring your feet pointing outwards and go wider with your legs. That's perfectly fine. Whatever feels good to you. And we're going to start, guys. So down and up. Well done. Let it begin. Let the fun begin. And really stay focused throughout. Okay. Focusing on your breathing. Inhaling, coming down. And exhaling, coming back up. Okay. We're halfway. For 10, 9, 8, 7. Five, well done. Four, keep those knees going out. Your toes are going out, follow with your knees. Last one, coming up to standing, guys. Side steps, so generally start with your feet under you. I want you to step out first, as we always do. 
Come into the lunge position first and then bring it back for 10. Nine. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. And one, swapping sides, guys. Feet under the hips, lunging out first before you begin. Lunge down, bring it back for 10. Nine, eight, seven. Really pushing that foot down to the floor. Well done. Four, three, two. We're going for squat jumps now, guys, okay? Get your stance ready first, squat down. Accelerate up for 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, explode up, come on, 4, 3, 2, 1, lovely, straight into squats guys, 20 reps, and down, good, now get your heart rate up a little bit, go, Ten more, please, for ten. Nine. Eight. Seven. Six. Three. Pushing the heels down, please. Squeezing the glutes on the way up. Three. Two. One. Side lunges. Bring the leg out. Get the right alignment first. Knee along your toes. Bring it back. For ten. Nine. Eight, seven, six, five, four. Well done. Stay with me. Last one on this side. Bring it back under the hips and lunge out. Get your body alignment right first. Bring it in for ten, nine. Well done. Hope everyone's okay. We are not in runners, just be mindful. Maybe go on to a nice cushion floor if uh, you're doing the high jump, squat jump, okay? And one more. Very good, squat jumps, guys, when you're ready. And go for 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Next step, straight in. Squatting down again for jelly legs. <laughs> Keep going. Well done. Your heart rate will level off after a few minutes. So just give yourself a chance. Breathe into it. Breathe loud if you need to. Good. For 10, 9. Well done. Five more, four, three, two. The last one of these guys, well done. Side lunges, when you're ready, lunge out, prepare, and go for 10, nine, eight, seven, six. Make sure that foot is fully planted on the floor, guys. Okay, three, Two, and last one, lovely stuff. Opposite way, get yourself right first, check your knee and your toes. Knee should be following your toes. Bring it back for 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five. Nice straight line with the opposite leg, please. Three more, two more. And last one, come on, last, last uh, squat jumps now, okay? Ready, go for 10. Nice and high, guys, really accelerating up. Come on, good. Use the arms to drive. Five, four, three, two, one. Well done, well done. Okay, next thing we're doing, four exercises. I'll just go through quickly. We'll drive the knee. Alternating, okay? 10 of them. We're gonna then jog on the spot nice and fast. Then we're going for lunges, okay? Up and down, staying as you are. 
Then onto the floor for press ups. Three rounds. And then we're down on the floor. Okay. So, first thing we're doing, knees under the hips. Bring the band down a little bit towards the knee. So, lower thigh. Drive up with the right leg for 10, 9, 8. Use your arms. Get the heart rate up higher using your arms. Okay. Four, three, two, one. If you've no band on, go high knees, okay? Jogging and lifting the legs. Other one, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Next thing we're doing, not jog, more of a steady pace, lifting the knees for 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, Three, two, one. Into the lunge position, please. Left leg in front, right leg behind. Okay, get your position right first. So bring the lower leg and the back leg down. And starting straightening into the front leg for 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Swap it over quickly. All right, get your position right. Lower lift for 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Onto the floor quickly, lads. Press ups. 10 reps. I'm being kind. All right, on the knees if you want. Ready? 3, 2, 1. Go for 10, 9, Eight, ma, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Lovely. Back up when you're ready. Mind yourself standing. All right. Again, driving the knee. Lift right leg is what I start with the last time. So start with that same leg. Good. For five, four, three, two. One, when you're standing on the opposite leg, make sure your hip isn't kicking out. Draw that belly in, nice strong standing leg, lift and lower, okay? Good. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. So just note, every time my leg comes back, quite long, straight legs, squeezing the glutes. So it's up and down, okay? From there, we're going for high knees. When you're ready for 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Lovely. Lunge, starting with that same leg again. When you're ready, 3, 2, 1, and go for 10, 9, 8, 7, Five. We're halfway through this set. Okay. Two. One. And swap over. We'll do it all over again. And then we're finished with that. Okay. Other leg, please. If you're not started. Okay. Seven. Six. Five. Four. We're heading back down to the floor again. Okay. So make sure that turnaround is quick. Without falling or hurting yourself. Down the floor for presses, please. If you want to try the full ones this time, do so. Okay? Ready and go for 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and back up. Okay. High knees again, please. Driving that right leg up. Goes so up, stand back, squeeze the glute. Up and down. Okay, use the arms. Get the heart rate up a little bit with the arms. Three more. Two, one. Swap it over. Left side. Lift and lower. Eight, seven, six, five. Four, three, two, one. Lovely stuff. All right. 
Ready? Last set of high knees, okay? Nice and quick. That's it. For five, four, three, two, one, and back to lunges. Right leg in front, if it was your right leg, the first time round, lower lift. Okay, so the leg you start first with, back with that leg again. Good. Nice heart rate going here. Okay, I'm being a two, maybe talking when I'm dying inside. Well done. One, walking over. Okay, lower and lift for 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Onto the mat again, press ups. Try even a couple of full ones, okay? Do a couple, even if it's two, if it's made of it. But try it, okay? And finish off on your knees, ready? Three, two, one, and go for 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Well done. Take a sip of water, please. We're hitting the mat and we're hitting it hard. No harder than what we've just done, though. Okay. So stay with me. Well done. So we're going to come down, keep the band on. We're going to come down to plank on the elbows. Okay. See me clearly. Let's forward a little bit. Well done. Okay. So coming down with your elbows. Giving you a nice few seconds recovery there. Being very generous. And we're going to come into a nice plank position. So pushing the heels away, squeezing the glutes. Nice long line with the body. Holding it for another five, four, three. And we're going to start to bring the leg out. One leg at a time. Left leg out, bring it back. Right leg out, bring it back. Left, center, right. Good. Halfway. Five, four, three, two, one. Lovely. Just come down onto your knees for a moment. We're going to come onto our hands. Make sure the bands are nice and secure, so bring them down a little bit if you need to. Okay, we're going to come into mountain climbers. Left knee in towards your hands. Bring it back. Right and left. Two, one, and for five more. Five. Four, three, two, one. Coming down. We're doing another two sets of that, guys. All right. I know repetition is a killer, but it makes you stronger. Back into plank position, please. If you could see the sweat on my forehead right now. Okay, ready. Onto your elbows. And hold. We're holding this for 10. All right. And then we're doing the legs. If the legs are too much, just hold the plank. Okay, two, one, and left leg, center, right leg, center, and left, and right. Halfway for five, four, three, two, one. Bring the knees down, come onto your hands, please, and lower the band with them, calm up your legs a little bit. Into plank position, nice long line before you begin. We'll bring our right knee in, extend back, left for eight, seven, push against the band, five, four, three, two, one, lovely. We're coming back down into plank position. All right, ready? I'm going to check on you now in a minute. Two, one, up you come, and hold for ten, nine, coming over, eight, Seven, six, good. Five, four, well done. Three, two, good stuff. One, and leg out, left leg. Doesn't matter, right leg, alternate. For eight, seven, good stuff. Six, five, four, three, two, 
And one, onto your hands, please. That's it, Anna, come on, no giving out. I'm watching you. My sweat is real, look. <laughs> onto your hands, into long high plank, please. Three, two, one, left knee in, please. For 10, alternate, nine, eight, good stuff. Seven, six, don't round the spine, Sarah. That's it, don't tuck the pelvis. And one, and come down, well done, everybody. Good stuff. Okay, just when you're doing that, you wanna watch for a second. Try not to round the spine, okay? Keep the spine long, see the difference? There's this, and then there's this, okay? See that? This is the way you should do it. Nice long spine, flat back, and then rounding is a no-no, okay? So just keep that in mind going forward. Well done. We're coming onto our backs for now. We're doing some abs. And then we're hitting the glutes. And then you're hitting, hitting the kitchen for a bit of grub and relaxation for the rest of the day. All right? And you can relax in your holiday zimmer. So come on onto your backs, please. All right. Uh, imprint with your lower spine. Okay, I've got a bun in my head, so I can't get my head down. Okay. So imprint in the lower back, okay? From there, we're bringing a, uh, both legs into tabletop position. Make sure that lower back is secure and down. Hands are behind the head, supporting the weight of your head. And we're gonna breathe in to stay. Those with bands on their legs, actually bring your legs slightly apart, okay? Just ever so slightly, so hip distance apart and push into the bands again. Inhale to stay, exhale, come up into out press. Inhale as you lower, and out. In, and out, good. There's no hanging around with these abs today, so stay with me, okay? One more, staying up, breathe in. Right arm hit to the left knee, good. And alternate sides for eight, seven. Keep the legs apart, four, three, two, well done, one. Stay up in your ab prep, please. Lower your right leg down towards the floor. Bring it back and swap. Left, back, right. Stay up in your ab prep, please. Support your head with your hands. So you should have no issues with the neck. For five, four, three, two, one. Keep the legs up. We're going to place the hands down. Okay, we're going to bring, do reverse curl. So bring the legs towards you. And bring them away for 10, nine. So lifting that lower spine off the floor. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Last one. Lovely stuff. Tabletop again. Come up into our prep. Okay, we're going to extend the legs. Nice and long, out and in for 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, bring it back. We're going to do that all over again. Well done. So bring the feet down for a moment. Okay, take a breath in. And on the exhale, if anything is too much with the legs in the air, you can always put, keep your feet on the floor and work through your exercises that way. Okay, so if it's too much for anyone, just put the feet down, but keep doing what we're doing, okay? So bring legs back into tabletop position, hands behind the head, take a breath in here. On the exhale, up you come, legs are pulling against the band, the resistance of the band, and lower down, and up. So the legs stay about hip distance apart, constantly pushing against the band. Not like you're kind of working about 20%, 30% effort against the band. Drawing that belly button down as you come up, okay, trying to push the belly out. Draw it down. My line is at the ceiling and then reaches your knees. So you follow the ceiling and then to your knees. And we're going oblique. So rotate for 10. Opposite side. Nine. Eight. Seven. Well done. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. One. Stay up. Lower the legs for 10. Opposite leg, nine, walking leg, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, 
one, extend the legs out, you can go high if it's too much, you can keep the knees bent if you want, and we're going out and in for 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, oh yeah, arms down by your sides, okay, reverse curls, legs back up if they're down, take a breath in, and exhale to lift your lower spine, and bring the legs away slower than they come in, and bring them, don't hit yourself in the face of your knees. Bring it up. Good. For four more. Last two. One more. Bring it down. Good. Okay. We're done with that, but we're just going to finish off with a little burner. So bring the arms behind your head. And on the exhale, we're going to come up, bring the legs apart. So you're pulling against the band and you're reaching between your legs. Okay, we're going to pulse here. Okay, nice, slow, short pulse. Okay, holding it. Don't lower too, down, too low down. Pulsing. You should feel a nice, nice burn there after activating the abs massively. Okay, for three. Two, one, just bring your legs down to the left side of the room, okay? And keep your, or sorry, bring your hands behind your head. And we're gonna do the same. Bring yourself up into an ab prep, but bring your legs to one side of the room. And gentle pulses for 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Slowly bring the legs back to center and let them fall out to the opposite side of the room. Okay, shoulders are facing forward. Okay, and again, bring yourself up first, and then slowly come down about halfway and back up. Okay, for your eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Lovely stuff. Okay, coming up. We're lying onto our right side, finishing off with glute activation. Nice strong abs after that left. You should definitely feel working. So nice long line with your body to begin. Okay, lift and lower. The loads. <laughs> A lot of reps. Okay. So get comfortable. Rest your head down, please. No pressure in the neck. Okay. Do ten more. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Keep the leg in line with your hip. We're going circles forward for 10, nine, eight, seven. If you're a bit unstable, bend the bottom leg. Okay, so you can bend your bottom leg if you feel that you're rocking too much. There should be no movement in the pelvis. Hold opposite way for 10, nine, eight, seven, six. Five, four, three, two, one. Hold and pulse for 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Bend the knees, okay? Into a clam position. So slightly forward, so you bring your knees forward. Don't have them in line with your hips and your heels are directly under the bony part of your arse, your arse, and your soles, your feet are away. Make sure your hips are level. We're going to lower and lift for 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Come up onto your elbow, please. We're going into side plank. We're going full side plank, no knees. So what I would suggest is you always start with a bent knee to get into position so you get into it correctly. Bring your top leg in front of your bottom leg. Support yourself with your upper hand. Elbow under the shoulder, get yourself right before you release and hold. Okay, and we're going to slowly bring that lower hip up and down for 10, 9, 8, 7. Your back is actually just hold the side plank. Okay, don't do the lower lift. One, slowly bring it down. Okay, we're going to do that all over again. So, may as well stay on this side. Otherwise, you'd be dizzy going back and forth. 
So just to get an extra bit of burn as well. So relax the head down, lower and lift again. We're doing two sets of this. We're on our second, okay? Well done. Four, three, two, and we're going for another one. Set of 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five. Draw the belly button in, activate the lower waist. One, whole circles forward for 10. Nobody dropping out now, I'm coming out to check. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. And the other way, please, for 10. Nine, control the pelvis, please. Control, Barbara, go smaller with your circles. Smaller, good. Go away, Dave. And hold and pulse for 10. Nine, eight, seven, six, five. Four, three, two, lovely, one. And bring it down onto side plank, okay? And as our clams, bend the knees, feet under your backside, and lower and lift for 10. Nine, keep the hips facing forward. Seven, six, five, four, three, two. What's the difference when you take a break? <laughs> okay. Top leg forward to support yourself with your hand, elbow underneath you, three, two, one, coming up. Have a little look, make sure your elbow's under your shoulder, and then release when you feel comfortable. If you need to support yourself with this hand, you can. Otherwise, lower lift, okay, keep going. We have five more. Anyone that's struggling, just hold the side plank, please. Two, one, drop it down, okay. Opposite side. Slowly coming around like a 90 year old <laughs> and resting down. Hope you're all okay. Support your head, please, with your arm. Okay, relax the arm down and lower lift. Two sets of this and then you're finito. Okay, well done. Breathing in and out. Three, two, and we have another 10 of these. So 10, nine, eight, Seven, no bend in the knee, please. Four, three, two, one. Okay, guys, there was a lot of movement in the pelvis, okay? So I really want you to go smaller with your circles. I want no shifting in the pelvis, okay? So you're going forward, please. Really small. Control with the abs. There should be no movement in the pelvis whatsoever. And hold and go the opposite way for 10, nine, eight, seven, Six, five, four, three, two, hold on pulse for 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Ooh, definitely more on that one. <laughs> okay, I'm going to get you to bring yourself to clam position. And we're gonna lift and lower for 10, nine, eight, Seven, so the whole leg is lifted, including the foot, okay? Three, two, one, and extend up onto your elbow, please. Front foot, top foot, sorry, top foot in front of your bottom, support yourself, and when you're ready, come on up into your side plank position. And when you're ready, lower and lift if you can for 10. Nine, eight, seven, Six, five, four, three, two, one. Coming down, please. Back onto your side. Last round. Ding, ding, ding. Okay. When you're ready, stay with me now. Okay. Do every single rep. Ready and lift and lower. Good. Keep that rhythm going, please. Up and down. And last 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. I'm coming over for the circles, okay? Go smaller with your circles forward for 10, nine, eight, seven, six, better, five, much better, Barbara. Good. And hold on back for 10, nine, good, eight, 
seven circles. Oh, yeah, what's it? Smaller, slower, yeah, Dermot. Slower down. <laughs> and one, good, hold and pulse, not a race. <laughs> He's going to make 40. Pulsing, okay, keep going. For five, four, three, two, and one. Bend the knees, please, okay? And we're going for clams. Lift and lower for 10, nine, eight, seven, six, good, five, four, three, two, one, back into your side plank, please. All right, when you're ready, three, two, one, and up you come. And last round, ready for 10, lower and lift, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, woo, same it is. and one, woohoo, we're done. Take the bands off for now. We'll use them for a couple of stretches. Good stuff. And I want you to start into mermaid pose first. So bringing, hold on, so wait, I'm going to get back in. So coming back uh, into a mermaid pose, so front leg bent and resting your foot onto your thigh. Okay. And just pushing open that uh, front leg, push the knee down gently. You find open the hip a little bit. You need to put a pillow under your bottom, do if you find that your leg is like this. Um, place a little pillow under your bum. It'll just help lift you up a little bit and take pressure off, okay? If it's handy, okay? From there, just reaching away from the front leg and reaching towards the opposite side. Hope you all enjoyed. Keep the hips open, trying to let the hip rotate forward. We want to keep the hips level. So keep that left hip back if it's your left arm over your head. Okay, and get a deep, deep stretch. And the leg down. Okay. And relax down, swap legs. Just reminder, Thursday evening, Emer O'Leary will be doing a guided meditation. So please try and make it. I've asked her to send me on some details, still waiting, but uh, just send them on in the next day or two, please God. And I'll send them on to you. Just about what it's going to be, what it entails. You need loads of blankets and pillows, lighting candles if you want. And um, bring the kids if you want as well. If you've got kids or a husband or a wife or a partner, or whatever. Um, everyone's welcome. Uh, for the relaxation part. That's if they let you relax. Okay, so make sure it's important that you get to enjoy the time as well. Okay. So coming onto your back, please. We'll just stretch out the group. Start with the hamstrings, please. So grab the band if you have one, it just makes it a bit easier and allows you to get a bit deeper into that hamstring. When you're ready, extending that leg straight, holding onto the bands securely, make sure it doesn't fly off and hit you. And bring the toes down once you're in that hamstring stretch, okay? Straight line with the leg. There, make sure you've got a pillow under your head. So you're not feeding into your back, please. And we'll just do the bending from the knee. So bend the knee, bring it towards your chest. And then just think with the foot that you're trying to push your foot towards the ceiling. So you're opening the back of the knee. Focus on opening the back of the knee and trying to straighten that leg, but trying to keep the upper thigh in where it is, like basically. So you're thinking with the foot, leading with the foot. Your leg should be shaking a little bit doing this. It's a lovely stretch. Great uh, sciatic nerve stretch, but also uh, the lower part of the hamstring and calf, the upper attachment of the gastrocnemius also. Okay. And slowly, slowly getting deeper into it and then release. Just holding the band. If it's on your uh, left foot, holding it in your opposite hand anyway. Hold the band in your opposite hand. And then bring your knee towards your opposite shoulder with the other hand. Forcing your leg on the outer part of the knee. Rest your foot um, onto your thigh. Okay, opening up the other leg, so pushing that knee away. Open up that hip. And when you're ready, place your hands around the thigh, underneath the leg, grab your thigh and slowly, if you can, 
draw that leg towards your upper body. Having a lovely stretch on the glute. A little bit of a nerve stretch as well. Good one. Great period form stretch. The muscle in your back side. Okay. Thighs over your sciatic nerve, so it's a very, very good one. Okay, we're going to swap sides. All right. We're going to wrap the band around the opposite foot. Stay with us if you can for the stretch, guys. It's just as important as the session you've just done. So please stay with us if you can. It's only another less than five minutes. Great. Nice long line with the leg. Toes down. And slowly, if you can, go a little bit deeper into it by pulling on the band. Or else just fold it where it is. But make sure your leg is completely straight. Hold it for five, four, three, two, and one. Bring that knee down towards your body, your belly area, towards your chest. Okay, and then from there, just thinking, if you want to bend your other leg to support yourself, just thinking with the foot. Again, imagine you're trying to reach your foot towards the ceiling, lengthen. My right side is definitely not as bad as my left. I can get into a straight position with my leg, no problem. But just one side will always be stronger and more flexible than the other. Still working. Holding for five, four, three, two, and one. Grabbing the band with the opposite hand. Support your knee on the outer part and guide it towards your opposite shoulder. And holding. And relax. Okay, take the band off your foot, place your foot onto your lower thigh, so just above the knee, and slowly pressing the knee outwards, open the hip. And when you're ready, grabbing the uh, underneath part of your thigh, reaching underneath, interlock your fingers, support yourself, rest your head, make sure your head is rested down on the floor and pull that leg towards you. Stretching your bum bum. Okay. Sometimes if you kind of rock your the leg that you're holding, if you kind of move slight, like a smidge into the left, you'll feel a deeper stretch in a different part of your um, glute area or if you kind of bring it back into the right and then go back out left again. You're rocking the leg left and right. Gives you a little kind of deeper stretch. Okay. And when you're ready, we're going to come to standing. Take your time. Okay. So just bring the left leg behind the right, just ever so slightly, and just bend both knees, keeping the heels planted. And holding. Walk over. And up and down. Okay. And then from there, just wide stance of the legs, bend into the right leg, hold slowly, and lean over to the left and to the right. Three more. Two and one more. Um, it's coming up to standing. I want you to reach towards the ceiling, keeping your feet flat on the floor, and just lift the rib cage. So I want you to really lift up out of the ribs, okay? So reaching, 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 breathing into these ribs. And then go wide with your arms, big circles with the arms and down, reaching on up again towards the ceiling. And exhaling, coming down. Just give me three more. Inhale to reach on up. Good. And exhaling, coming down. And two more. Inhale, reaching. And exhaling. Follow your hands this time. So looking up at your hands, stretching the neck. And exhaling, coming down. Good. Bring the arms up over your head, and this is the last one, I promise. Interlock your fingers, actually, and then leaning towards the right side. Just don't go too deep. Coming back up the center, and leaning towards the left. One more each side, center, right. Back up the 
center and up. And go down, and then just feet go wide. Bring the arms, please. No tension, breathe in, out. Just a dead weight with the arms, please. And last one. Well done. Hope you all enjoyed. Just uh, pause the recording.